What if I told you that there is a place where you can sit on one side of the river for a luxury picnic and spot tigers and elephants on the other side? Yes, we are heading to a beautiful spot in Karnataka called Kabini near Nagarhul Tiger Reserve. This area is surrounded by Bandipur Tiger Reserve and Nagarhul Tiger Reserve with the Kabini River flowing through it, adding to its excitement. You can reach here from Bengaluru in 4 hours and the nearest big city is Mysuru. Alternatively, you can also reach via Mangalore. If you are planning to visit places like Mysuru or Kurg in this area, consider stopping by here. The place I am about to show you has a village on one side of the river and fierce tigers and other wild animals on the other side. You can hear their roars or can watch them through binoculars. So let's dive in and discover more about this place. All your friends are saying you're doing fine But how about last night? Kabini area, the main market area, but I did not book any accommodation for tonight and that was probably not a great idea, especially because this is weekend, every place is booked, every place is booked, no matter how much amount of money you are ready to pay. Yeah, I got some basic accommodation as you can see there, uh, it is just 1000 rupees, however it's a clean room, so yeah that's okay for us tonight. Tomorrow we are going to a very nice place, wait for that, let's go and try local food now, let's find out some. So we Absolutely. ate a lot and slept well at a small motel by the road in Kabini. A big day is coming up and we still need to plan it well. Oh, how will I get through all these nights when I'm alone? I keep scrolling through my phone now. I wish there was a pill to get over someone you love but doesn't have. This place is close to Kabini River, so we'll have breakfast very quickly and go explore Kabini. When I'm in South India, I really enjoy trying local foods like filter coffee, sek dosa, puttu, and kadalakari, among others. And now it's time to hit the road. Before leaving my motel, I met Mr. Shiva. He shared stories about the wildlife activities here. He had even gone on a tiger safari that morning. He gave us tips on how to book a safari and where to stay. Details in the description by the way. He also suggested to do self-drive trip to Bavli check post. The route goes through raw, untouched jungle and if you are lucky, you might spot some big animals, maybe even a tiger. So I decided to hop on and try my luck here. So we reached Nagarhol Tiger Reserve checkpoint. I guess this is the checkpoint. I'm not sure. Uh, I, we might get booking office as well. We are just going to go inside and check. This is Kanana Kakana Kote. It is written Kakana Kote Safari Center. A Kakana Kote or Kakana Kote Safari Center. Uh, so let's just go inside and inquire more about the safari. Chale? Tiger Piche. Oh, tigers everywhere. Elephants and tigers everywhere. My goodness, a lot of birds also. 
what i understand that you need to come well in advance because this place might get really really crowded especially during the weekend times and you can see there the timing is written but uh, i think for the morning safari you need to reach here by 5:15 or 5:30 because it is first come first served basis the afternoon safari this is closed right now but we will come again after 12 pm and we will see what time the gate opens oh, oh. time to go to the resort it's a very nice one i tell you so i want to experience many local activities there so let's go so right now we are driving towards bavli check post uh it's a beautiful drive i tell you it, it is one of its kind experience uh, in some places yeah the road condition is a bit bad as we can see now uh we started from uh, nagarhol uh, tiger reserve checkpoint it's a beautiful drive it's actually a drive through dense jungle and you it's it's basically a self drive experience as you can see but you have to drive like slowly carefully because you can uh, because any animal can come in front of you uh, like uh, it can be tiger it can be elephant and yes i have talked to people who have seen them the animals basically ah the sound of nature everywhere so we have kept our windows open just enjoying the drive the nature and uh, just exploring karnataka Wild elephant. It's a tusker there, there over there. wildlife resort this is right beside kabini river as you can see there and there are so many activities that you can do here it is so refreshing so green it's raining sometimes i am totally loving it here let's just have a great time here ta da so guys guess what right now i'm going for some activities in the river actually it's kind of a boat there is a local name for it let me tell you but it's not like a boat boat is a very small one so let's go there and experience that well that is my cottage and i'm going to the river that's in front of me let's go all your friends are saying you're doing fine but how will it be as night when you cry your eyes Kabini River, as you can see, and this is monsoon time, so the river level is really high. And this is our evening setup this evening in Lincoln Wildlife Resort. We are going to have a really nice evening, and this is the sunset time.
ये देखो सभी डुबल रिकॉर्डिंग so dreamy feels like wild and free this is the monsoon time the water level is high and i'm just having such a great time here <laughs> ओ oh, इसको बोलते कोराकल ओ oh, पहले बंबू का था हाँ. अभी बंबू का होने के बाद ये प्लेवर्ड का तरफ बनाया है अच्छा सेफ्टी के लिए या या तो लोकली अभी भी बंबू यूज होता है कहीं कहीं अभी भी कभी भी विलेज होते हैं हाँ. कभी भी विलेज में होते हैं तो और डर लगता होगा ना उसमें तो हाँ या इसलिए सच्चे पहले वही था अच्छा पहले वही था इसी में कम से कम इसमें आठ नौ आदमी बैठ सकते हैं अच्छा आठ नौ आदमी आया आया शो इज इट दैट स्टेबल ओ माय गॉड आई डू नॉट नो दिस इज सो टाइनी सो स्मॉल इवन थ्री पीपल फील लाइक टू मेनी हियर so i haven't done picnic in a while and my god this is such a dreamy i mean location for picnic i would say so right in front of me this is the kabini river i'm watching a beautiful sunset and the best part is that you know when you cross the river there is the forest area dense forest and i am trying to spot some animals there yes you can actually spot them and if you come before monsoon like uh, may june time then you can actually spot lot of animals there a herd of elephants maybe yeah i'm coming back definitely the picnic time This is the post sunset calmness the post sunset colors Can you hear the birds by the way the sound of nature the sound of water the sound of forest it's so so beautiful so amazing a spooky night in the jungle surrounded by the sounds of animals we spent a great time by the bonfire listening to scary stories and enjoying the delicious homemade food at the resort and now after dinner it's time to have the sweet dish this is a local sweet dish called puran puli and we have put some ghee mm. this is so good 
This trip to Karnataka was short but incredible. I experienced so much diversity in nature, culture and food. There is still so much more to explore in Karnataka and I can't still wait to come back soon to discover more beautiful places.